What's up guys, McRaven the Miner here, and welcome to the fourth episode of the Town series. Uh, in the last three episodes, we went through the tutorials, and now it's time to start an actual map. Now, here's our choices. Uh, the, difference, the difference between normal and mixed, I honestly couldn't tell you. Uh, we're going to go normal and start new game. Yes, start a new game. Now, full disclosure, the reason it was asking me if I wanted to delete my old map is because I did try this out a little bit on my own. Be totally honest with you. Um, and the reason I did that was so I could figure out what the heck I'm doing in this game. And, all right, let's see. This is where we spawn. This is where it all begins. And I really want to be over here, I feel like. Unfortunately, I'm over here, um, and I really don't want to go through these frog dudes. So, all right, we got 11 citizens. This is where we're starting. Um, what if I just say, let's bring this up, chop down this area. Oh, I guess we got to scroll down. There we go. Got to get on the right level. And chop down this area. Yes, cool. We're going up and over this mountain. Sweet. All right, so here's the plan. Let's clear out all of this. And I think we'll gather some, uh, some fruits from over here as well. Let's look around the map. Let's see what we got here. All right, all right. Wheat we need to be on the lookout for. We're definitely going to need lots of that. Wow, they cut that uh, down so fast. Okay. Um, do I want to be maybe in this area? I'm thinking. How big is this? That's a big mountain. This one's not so big. So yeah, I think we'll start right here where, we're, where we are. Um, but let's clear down these trees as well. Might as well get that started. Now, I also spent a lot of time on the forum, so I was able to pick up on a few you know, tips and tricks. Um, see, these guys right here, they're actually fighting these guardians that spawn, and somebody died already! Who was that? There's a human corpse. Great. Alright, well... Now we got all that chopped down. Let's start by establishing a carpentry zone. Now, in my uh, research, we'll call it, like I said, I picked up on a lot of tips and tricks and everything like that, and I've also picked up on a lot of stuff that I'm not going to do. For example, uh, when you put down these zones, you actually don't need walls around it at all. Now, I just kind of straight up don't like that idea. I'll be honest with you. So let's put start with a log wall here. Kind of wall this sucker off. I like the raw wood look for a carpenter, right? I think that looks pretty cool. Pretty neat. Um, and you know what? We're actually gonna put another wall down too. Wait till they finish that. All right, now we can go up a level and do the same thing. Now I'm holding down shift after I place a string like this because that allows me to place another there you go now they're covering that up and we'll put a roof on it as well but first let's put down nope the side utilities carpenter's bench gotta have a carpenter's bench oh and as far as this human corpse I can actually right click and destroy human corpse and it'll go away. And I can do that to these tin clouds as well. I know these are really bad uh, for my my people, my townies. I mean, for obvious reasons, I feel like. Okay, so we have two layers of wall. We've got a table, a uh, carpenter's bench. Let's put a wood detailer in here as well. I'm sure we're going to need one of those soon. And while you go find that... Um... Let's get a door up in there. 
Door. Not a roof. A door. Other? No. Decorative walls? No. Hey, a door, please. That's right. I think it's in... Furniture? Yep. Doors. That makes sense, right? Hey, let's put this log door on there, right? Makes sense to me. Sweet. Now, for a roof, I think right now we don't have very many options. Uh, let's just look at it real quick. Straw. These take stone. I don't have any stone. Don't want to waste my wheat quite yet. Uh, I could do wood. But I think that might be a bit much right there. So we're actually just going to move on real quick. Um, where to move on to? Food. Food is going to be a priority here. Um, let's start by gathering all of the fruit. That's how we're going to start. I think that's a safe bet. Um, looks like I actually have, have them gathering wheat as well. That's not a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. Yep, gathering the fruit. Gathering the wheat. And... Let's see. We should really start some farms as well. Now here's, I actually learned quite a bit about this, okay? Um, when you till soil and you plant trees on it, those trees constantly regrow. So you don't have to constantly keep planting trees, they just keep regrowing, which is pretty fantastic. Um, now for farms, I think I'm actually going to start just right here. Right there. That'll be our wheat farm. Hmm. Just kind of glance around again, see what we have. Still have 10 villagers. That's good. We need a good name for these guys. A good, uh... We need a good name for kind of our, our town here, our nation, and for our peeps as well. Alright, so hopefully they dig all that up. We can plant some wheat. Oh, who died? Did somebody die? I don't think so. A chicken died, apparently. Hmm. I'm still very fresh at this. Fresh faced kid playing this game. Alright, come on, hurry up. Hurry up. Almost done. Okay. Now we can plant wheat. Through all of this. Except for that, apparently. And where that log is. That's fine, we can take care of that later. Um, yep, go plant the wheat. Perfect, perfect. Also, uh, I think it's time we plant some trees as well. And I like to keep it near the carpenter. That sounds like a good idea, right? I think we can put it right up against the back wall. I think we'll leave a row. We'll do three rows and we'll skip a space. I think that looks neat. So we'll till all that up. We'll plant some more trees. That way we don't have to worry about wood in the future. It's just kind of there. We're good. We can set up some automatic wood harvesting. Um, now, one thing I brought up in the, the tutorial videos, one thing I was really frustrated with, couldn't quite figure out, I wished there was a way to do it, um, was priority, priorities. Prioritizing different tasks, you know, what the, uh, the townies will go accomplish before they accomplish other things. Well, it's actually here, it's been here all along, and it's actually called the priorities panel. Just click right here, boom, priorities. Pretty sweet, if you ask me. Um, every one of these, like baking and cooking, this is your first priority. You can move this down or up and get that with anything here, which the defaults are actually set pretty perfectly um, for when you start out, in my opinion. We'll alter that later, I'm sure. Uh, not harvest. Let's plant some trees. Just regular trees. Pine trees? Yeah, we'll do pine trees. All right. Lots and lots of pine trees. Can't get enough. Ooh, you know what? Maybe that was not a good idea. Because 
Okay, they plant the trees from these bushes on the ground. Um, and they will travel far and wide to get those bushes. Didn't even think of that. Is this gravel? It'd be nice to find some good resources uh, just kind of hanging up out here. Somewhere. But alas, not today. Not today. Okay, so they're planting that. I uh, wish we had more wheat. Actually, I actually think we can right click and harvest. And then they should pick that up and go plant it uh, in our area. Take that one. Take this one. Ooh, this one. Now, this is something we actually learned in our tutorials, too. Um, how to farm wheat, you know, and make bread. And that's kind of the plan right now. Of course, to do that, we first need a masonry. So let's plant this. Uh, I think we'll plant it, <laughs> build it, how about? And I think we're going to do this more over here in this area. Someone died again. Great. Bezel Buit Corn Cornelis? Poor guy. What happened? Well, it looks like they should almost have enough bushes here. <laughs> I just hear death sounds everywhere. It's making me nervous. The more villagers we have, the better. The more efficient we'll be able to run everything. Of course, the more food they'll take, too. But regardless. Don't go down here, bro. Don't. Don't get killed. Oh, there it is. Human corpse. Let's destroy that. That's not good. And I actually believe that the, uh, the ghosts that we've seen in the past spawn from those corpses. I'm quite positive that's the case. So, destroying those is definitely a good idea. All right, we have our masonry area set up. We need to put a wall around it. Um, so let's do like this wooden wall here. Hmm, wooden spiked wall. We gotta play with that later for sure. All right, let's place this around. There we go. Put the door right there. So they'll go place that. They should, I believe, harvest and plant these first. <sighs> Did we lose another? Come on, man. Oh, we're down to seven. Oh, and these guys are stuck up here. Oh, damn. We suck at this game. There. Okay, what I did is I took some scaffolding and put some scaffolding here. That goes up really quickly. Um, I think they actually make it for free. I could be wrong. Um, but it acts as a stairway for them to actually build upon. Now, I think they're actually going to build the whole wall first. So that's great. Fantastic. Down to six. Six citizens. There's three up there doing nothing. You're sleeping. And then you two working. Great. Great. This is how it begins. <sighs> Embrace the suck. This is going to be a while. Hey, you're able to get down now. Great. I'll leave that there, actually, so we can put a roof up later. Um, now, what are these guys doing now? Our trees are coming in nice. That's good. That's good. Oh, this is not the way I wanted to start. All right. Well, they put up the walls there. We are going to need... Where's it at? A mason's bench. Of course, you need stone to be able to make it. We don't have any stone. So it looks like we need to go mining. Yes! Now that's my ticket. Y'all go ahead and finish this wall first. And where are we going to do the mining at? It's going to be nice to just kind of dig it on the side of the hill, I suppose. That's a definite possibility. Or 
of course, this one as well. Um, but, oh, auto-saving, great. I think the easiest way to start out here is actually going to be just mining up like this little surface rock right here. Boom, take that up. That should be a good start. And then we'll need a Mesa's bench. And I think we're actually going to put two of them here. One, two. Won't let me. Great. I do have a wood detailer, right? No! Okay, they haven't placed the wood detailer yet because they needed the stone. You see, wood, wood, stone. So now they placed that. Now I should be able to place a Mason's bench, I believe. Yep, two of them. All right, now they've got some stone there to pick up. What are you guys doing? Like, there's no work to do. Okay, here's what we can do. Harvest all the wheat that's grown. Cut down these trees. And then mine up that little bit of rock sticking up. These are your missions. See, there we go. Now they can just replant what they harvest. So that's not bad. Let's um, cut the mushroom bush. That's it. that's in our way. I don't like that. And what kind of... Wait, hold on. Mushroom bush. What kind of mushrooms grow on a dang bush? I'm lost. There they go. All right, now I know there's a couple different ways we can establish, you know, item storage and everything like that. Um, we are going to look into that very soon. Not right yet, though. Not right yet. Let's wait till these guys get uh, get all this cut down. We're going to need to focus on food very shortly. How are you guys doing on food anyway? Let's see. Citizen tab. Of course, we have less mouths to feed now. I guess that's being an optimist. Ooh, these guys need to eat soon. Well, this one. 1,500 ticks. Okay. But, of course, we can always harvest these as well. Get some fruit. No big deal. Um, what do we got? What do we got? Okay, I got our masonry benches down. We got some wood. Um, keep harvesting this stuff. Keep, keep doing that. We're going to need that. Uh, let's see. Now we need to build this wall up, that's for sure. Uh, let's do a little smarter this time. How about that? Is that a possibility? Maybe put some scaffolding down to start out with? There we go. Now, some walls. Around here, around here, here, and here. Fantastic. Now, one thing we can do, you know, we could probably just start looking into storage now a little bit, a little bit, while we're still harvesting this wheat. We need to get our wheat kind of uh, stores established. Um, where, where is that? Where is that? Containers. Check this out. Okay. So remember before we were putting down these uh, stockpiles we could determine what items go in there and everything like that well we can actually do that with these barrels as well but just take a few wood to make and uh they can actually hold 10 items a piece and just like the stockpiles you can dictate what goes in it and what doesn't so let's get a raw materials barrel and where do we want to put these let's uh kind of line this area with them there we go. That could be kind of nice. You know, maybe I wanted it more visible a little bit, but that should be fine. It will take a considerable amount of wood to make. Three each, right? Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. So we may have to cut down those trees again. That's fine. Keep cutting down them trees. Of course, we need to finish this wall here as well. 
And uh, I think we're going to do... I really want to do a straw roof on here. I think we're going to hold off to do that. We'll wait till we get enough wheat. We'll do a little straw roof here. I think we will do a stone roof here, though. Well, what do we have for, ro for roofs? Wooden roof. Wood. Clay. At least take color. I don't really want color on there right now. Hmm. Maybe I could do a wooden roof on here. We can see what that looks like. Of course, before we do that, let's get some more scaffolding going on. Put that down, and then we'll put one on top as well. There we go. So now again, it acts as a, kind of a stairway headed up. You're tracking. Uh, okay, these barrels. Uh oh, they're already putting items in it. Here's what I want. And these barrels, I'm going to disable all. All right. I don't want bones in there. I don't want anything in there except for wood. These are our wood barrels. Disable all. These guys are going to get pissed off at me because they're coming by and trying to drop all the, their materials off. But that's fine. Chop down that wood, and then we're going to need to harvest this again. Now, manage container, materials, enable wood. Perfect. Manage container, materials, enable wood. We're just going to do that for these five, because that allows us to store 50 wood total once that one gets built. Materials and wood. Perfect, we're getting there down here. You missed one. What's your name? Rose. You missed one, Rose. Now you got it. Oh, you got another one too. You got another few of them. Yes! Our wheat farm's finally filling itself out. Now, what I think we might want to do is actually add maybe a little storage room to the masonry. Instead of having the barrels outside, we'll keep the barrels of wood outside of here. But what if we connect a little stock room, you know what I'm saying? We could actually make this look pretty cool, I think. Um, let's see. We'll do a similar floor just for fun. something like this and we'll add the same wall around it just like that and I think we will have to destroy that wall there we'll put a door there I think oh that reminds me we could put a door out front too so let's do that Where did I find those doors? Furniture. Ooh, windows. That's probably a good idea. I don't have any glass. I don't even know how to make glass. Oh, man. I still have a lot to learn. I'm definitely going to look that up. And ooh, let's put a nice wooden door here. So, let's see. I need to look up how to make glass. Um, I need to get better at saving our citizens' lives. I need to plant those wheat here. Why is that not done? Plant it there, plant it there. And you have two right there, perfect. And you guys are hungry. Great, great, don't starve, please don't starve. Go ahead and cut down, don't, don't cut them down, but harvest all that fruit. That's what we need to do. Because you look like you're about to starve to death. Miss Miss Maggie. Miss Margaret. There we go, we got fruits. We're good, we're good. <sighs> breathe, 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 breathe. Alright, so. We're getting there, we're getting established. 
Um, I don't have the food as far along as I'd like to. We can definitely work on that next. Um, right after I finish some storage for the masonry. And then hopefully put some roofs up too. All right. Cool. All right. Now I think time wise, I am going to wrap up this episode here. But I hope you've enjoyed what we've got started so far. Um, definitely let me know in the comments here if you have any questions, any suggestions. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, tell me I suck at the game. Whatever. Do your thing. Um, but hey, I'm learning. Hopefully you guys are able to learn a little bit with me too. And I hope you guys will be here for the next episode of Towns. So anyway, this is Mick Raven the Miner signing out.